Hola, this is Alicia Monet, and I wanted to share my meditation experience um, with everybody via video instead of writing it down. When we went through the meditation and we, we first saw the beauty in nature, I saw the sunset, I saw the ocean, the sunset above the ocean. It was like a picture that was moving. Um, I saw trees, I saw flowers, and I saw the flowers actually blooming. Like, like when you watch a movie and it's like fast forwarding, when, when we were talking about, well, when Jay, when you were talking about, um, that there's a natural discipline, I saw like fast motion, like these flowers blooming. I saw, um, caves, I saw trees and the ocean. I just kept going back to the ocean, to the ocean when we were walking on the dirt road, I don't know what it is about me, but I wasn't just walking. I was walking really fast, and I was feeling the dirt in between my toes. Before you told me anything about trees, I was walking down this long row of trees on both sides. That's where I started walking, and it was it was beautiful, and the, the dirt felt good because I was barefoot. I was loving it, and then the lakes. We walked past the two lakes, one on fire, and then the house with the green door. We walked past that. And then there was an entrance to a freaking rainforest. And I was like, oh my gosh, because I, I was there. Like, I was totally there. And I, was, I said to myself in the meditation, oh my gosh, is this real? Because it looks so real. And before you even said enter the rainforest, I ran in the rainforest. I ran in the rainforest and I was like rubbing my body against like the trees with the moss on it. And just like rubbing it like, like, a, like an animal. <laughs> Like an animal, and I, I was paying attention, listening to the sounds and the colors. I stopped myself from like exploring, physically exploring it, you know, with my body and touching and feeling. And uh, decided to um, to listen and see. So I saw the um, macaws and the snakes and just listening to the sounds it sounded like a soundtrack to a movie it was very really nice and then we walked out of there and saw the two pyramids and when we went into my heart's hall of justice of truth and we seen the green light my heart appeared as the matrix screen with all of the stuff coming down you know what i'm talking about like the, the matrix code but it was blue it wasn't green and it was like my heart it was like all these different codes just going and going. It was moving like a screen. It was moving. It was nonstop movement. Then when the lady appeared with the wings and the feather, she told me to admit all of my shit. I was like, oh my gosh. Now, she said your whole life, every lie, everything that you regret, everything, everything, right? And the thing is, I couldn't go past 2008 before 2008 because I already cleared that stuff up it's pretty interesting so from 2008 forward I was like oh my gosh and those cords okay so I got the knife and I was like well these cords I didn't just I could have just cut them in one fair swoop that didn't happen I had to cut those cords it was hurting it it hurt my arms were like like I needed muscles, and then there was this one cord that was not a little cord. It was this thick, it was really, like, thick cord like that. But it was the whole freaking cord, and it was so hard to cut that one. I was cutting, 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 and instead of cutting that one straight across, it ended up being, like, a diagonal, like, shh. It took me forever to cut that cord, and it was tiresome. I was like, fuck. But then I grew wings. <laughs> And then I grew wings. I was out. You didn't have to tell me to fly anywhere. I was gone. First place I went to was Machu Picchu. I went to Machu Picchu. And um, I was at the top of this, this temple. I don't even know if that temple really exists in my mind. There was this temple that had a slit. And I was there. And I was holding on to both sides of the uh, temple slit. Way up high. And I was doing flips. I was like, wee, this is fun. And the sun... You could see the sun was about to set. 
it wasn't like setting yet. It was like right at that moment where um, the time right before it sets. So it was still like dusky light. It wasn't even like setting. It was still in the sky, but it was about to set. And I was just doing flips. And then I went to the ocean and I was like doing nose dives and going do, 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 across the water. And I was just in the ocean. I was in the Atlantic Ocean. I went to the Indian Ocean. Um, and then we we went to go heal people. The first place I went to was East was West Africa. I went to West Africa and I was hugging all the kids. I was hugging them. I, I wrapped them in my wings and I was just like uh, breathing on them and like taking deep breaths and hugging them. And that's how I healed everybody everywhere that I went. I went to East Africa, then South Africa. I mean, West Africa, South Africa, East Africa, North Africa. I went to India. I went to South India. I went to, um, Central America, like the Panama, that area, and uh, the Panama, Panama, that area, and just like hug the people there. I went to, um, then I saw all my family and friends, and I healed everybody in my life that I connect with, that all the people that are close to me, um, I just gave them love. And for them, I didn't hug them and wrap them in my wings. I just like flew over them and like my wings covered them like as I flew over them and just healed all of them. I went to um, Haiti in the Dominican Republic and I just I wrapped my wings around the whole country. The whole country is it a country? God damn now I sound ridiculous. The whole island. <laughs> I'm not a geography major. OK. And then I went over to um, to Australia. I went to Australia I went to um, Laos. Is that how you pronounce it? I don't even know why I went there, but I went there. I hugged some people there. I went to and I flew past Hawaii. I didn't stop though to heal anybody. Where else? That was about it. That was that was about it. And um, when I woke up, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Those cords were no joke. I feel like I gained muscles. I'm cutting those cords. All right. That's my report. I'm so late in uh, making this video. Um, hopefully, I'll post it in due time, like before the next class. I hope so. Oh, I need to, gosh dog it, because this is discipline week. All right. Peace.